Welcome back, in this movie we will know more about the environment and lights. Aim to solo light by clicking the icon of light. As you can see you have directional and environment light. In directional light you have four types, you know them for sure, I'm just saying. And of course the most important one. That is sunlight. As you can see sunlight casts significant sunny daylight shadow. You need some little experience with lighting or maybe you're a filmmaker or a photographer who already knows what is circle light or square light or even what's three point light and how to use it. If you feel confused just drop it, for now, we will go back for it soon. Environment lights determine how the final look of your scene and it affects all objects in the work area much more than directional lights, it kind of sets the mood for upcoming events. Let's choose this one and make a scene to see the impact of this environment. I will time lapse this process as you should have known what's the hill is going on here. Okay, let's apply a three point light. If you check the scene menu, you'll find three new layers maybe under environment light which is key, fill and backlight. To have a little thought on how three-point light works perfectly, let's check this image. As you can see generally speaking key light tend to be close and intense. Fill light covers another side of that object. And the backlight setting slightly in the back of the scene. Back to the lights in the project, select the key light and click this icon here to aim in the right place, same with other lights, and keep tweaking, adjusting and improvising. You also can change or tweak any setting of any lights or apply images from your computer to the environment and it will have reflections on the scene. But don't try to add too much light because it will make the scene overexposed. So in order to fix it, you will double up the time of tweaking and previewing. Now preview. Isn't it beautiful? I feel happy with this. In the next one we will know how to render. See you next.